The curs will pay for that. We'll roll tonight. Mirror, mirror. Who shall die tonight? I'm parched. <laughs> Seems I got carried away. I'm part. Ah, your head. Yeah. <laughs> another night, another conquest. Scream as loud as you can, Condemn. <laughs> this rattle isn't worthy of my presence. Terribly sorry, but it seems your time has come.
those who do not submit must die. Choose quickly. Evil will not spread by itself. I am pleased with these offerings. Take them. I hear the murmurs of the trees. They're fed up with humans. Let us answer their prayers. Souls rotten with vice. <laughs> It's not my head, but it'll do. Really? It's for me! souls. All those innocent souls I harvested will finally be of use. Take everything you can. Choose quickly. Evil will not spread by itself.
I hate fields. I'd love to see them burn. My disciples arrive at the sanctuary. There they discover a priest who no longer preaches. He tells them that he took part in the creation of a monster, who then returned to dispossess him of his inspiration. Caleb. We offer him a chance to take his revenge on his creature. He accepts. My disciples, on the pretext of making a trap, take one of his hairs and ask for a fragment of Caleb. He gives them a bit of the wood used in his making. The two elements of the ritual secure inside the puppet. My disciples and the priest go their separate ways. The latter leaves for the town of New Florentine to find Caleb, and my servants set off for an abandoned farm. The people fear me once again. That is how it should be. The curse will pay for that. Terribly sorry, but it seems your time has come.
game are we playing? I shall reforge the world in my image. The dice were loaded from the start. Your head just isn't in the fight. I'm listening, master. What game are we playing? Little me. Who shall die to me? <laughs> My power is invincible. With that, the humans will finally submit to my yoke. Finally, fresh. With that, the humans will finally submit to my yoke. Finally, fresh souls to talk. This forest isn't so terrifying. Not yet. I accept my punishment. <laughs> Sacrifice to dominate. Simple mortal trinkets. You'd better find a use for them. I'm terribly sorry, but it seems your time has come. Mira, Mira. Who shall... I want to be done! Hmm. <laughs> 
Who should I kill? Anka! Hillocks and fields as far as the eye can see. This scene lacks chaos. At your service, master. Souls rotten with vice. Knowledge is power. The Conductor of Souls finally deigns to show himself. Don't make him wait. I am pleased with these offerings. Take them. This place is teeming with life. There are so many souls to reap. I'm terribly sorry. 
but it seems your time has come. Should I kill? Fragment of power for my disciples. Curse will pay for that. My disciples find the abandoned farm. There, using their own blood, they draw a network of symbols on the floor. When they have finished, they honor my name and recite the words of incantation. The puppet suddenly burst into flames, a long tongue of brown flame rising from the small wooden body without damaging a thing. In the distance, a cry rings out. We are close to making Caleb slightly more human, slightly more mortal. My disciples leave to meet up with the priest in the town of New Florentine. Ah. 
Ah, screams of terror. Such sweet music to my ears. You shall not leave until all the mortals in this region have bowed down before me. There's nothing like the vile. Many humans lie dead among the roots of these trees. I quite like this place. I heard you. You called me three times. going to love it.
With that, the humans will finally submit to my yoke. Trinkets. You'd better find a use for them. Scream as loud as you can. Take everything you can. Souls rotting. I am pleased with these offerings. Take them. When I give, I get. Take everything you can. With that, the humans will finally submit to my yoke. What a wretched pile of sticks. I heard you. You called me three times. Gamer, we play near me. Who shall die tonight? Who should I kill?
Who should I kill? Anka! I'm parched. You'll soon be ancient history. What game are we playing? Take everything you can. Choose quickly. Evil will not spread by itself. I am pleased with these offerings. Take them.
Since many souls here, I must have them all. The waters of the Styx are... Going to love it. What game, Mirror Mirror? Who shall die tonight? Listening. Who should 
I kill. Don't worry. The blade is sharpened to perfection. Such a powerful relic was hidden in this rat hole. My disciples arrive in the town of New Florentine, where they have planned to trap Caleb. The priest, visible to all in the middle of the main street, is trembling like a leaf. When Caleb appears, he collapses to the ground, all his courage having taken flight. Fortunately, Caleb does not yet know fear, and he approaches the cleric, intrigued. At that instant, my disciples destroy the cursed puppet. The priest dies instantly, and his soul leaves his body to seek shelter in that of Caleb. The latter utters a howl of anger and runs off, henceforth unable to use the claw of Geryon. Fear my rage. These relics will only make our conquest more bloody. Perfect. No one stands against the Prince of Hell! Many humans lie dead among the roots of these trees. I quite like this place. Choose quickly. Evil will not spread by itself. All the mortals! Mirror, mirror. Who 
shall die tonight. <sighs> I'm parched. I'm parched. Who should I kill? <laughs> 